22 is the median age of Pakistani youth, the Pakistani population. They're very receptive to technology. And Ali, you have experience in AI businesses, startups. We have a lot of students ready to join the bandwagon with the resources and the issues we have. Uh, what is your recommendation? Where to start from? Yeah, uh, that's, a, that's a really interesting question. I, I talk to a lot of people about this uh, very frequently. Um, I, I think uh, we've, in, in the VC industry, if you look at the last two to three years, 2021, early 22 was all about crypto. And then everybody since like mid of maybe like last year, everybody is thinking about AI and everybody's like, everybody that you talk to is trying to do something in the, in the AI space using generative AI tools. Uh, they don't have a very clear understanding of the problem that they're trying to solve. So everybody's taking a very problem, uh, like technology first approach, um, which in my opinion is, is, is a, is a problem. And, and I think like, I, I see this pattern a lot. Uh, I talked to a lot of like, uh, like first time founders, early, early, early stage founders who are, who are just picking up a technology component and then they're trying to build a business on top of it. Uh, so I, I, because I think that's wrong, like I, I generally, the way I think these things should be done is in the exact opposite uh, way. I think even if you want to build a build an AI business, you uh, you want to do a couple of things. One, you have to fundamentally start with the problem first. You have to understand the industry, irrespective of the problem that you want to uh, solve uh, using AI. Forget about AI. Just go deep into that industry and in, in understand their problems, understand the constraints, talk to people, um, live their life for a bit so that you really understand how things happen today. And uh, then you'll figure out the right product that, that you build. Now, that's one. Two, once you figure out the product that you want to build, even then, I don't think AI is a, is a solution you want to focus on, on on day one. You first want to, like, ir irrespective of how you do it, whether you use humans or, 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 or use uh, uh, reinforcement, like uh, you human in the loop or, uh, or, or any other uh, hacks, um, just try to build the product and get it uh, out in the market as soon as possible and validate that uh, product. See if it makes sense. Um, see if people are biting on the solution. Once you validate the solution, then the third step is actually like a, 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 in incorporating uh, AI or, or making it more sophisticated. And even then, I think what you need to do is um, the, the first model that you will build will always like fail. Like it, it, it will not work. You cannot assume that that you you will build a model you'll deploy it and it'll just work in in fact it's a better assumption to assume that it's not work it it will not work so you have to figure out strategies on on how to um how to um like collect more data from the field uh understand what is happening with the model and improve it over time to build the build uh, build and improve your product experience so so like just to summarize three things focus on the problem um get to the market as soon as possible and then uh, be prepared to do a lot of iterations to, to improve the product experience. <laughs>